Hey guys, Silence CL here. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Cafe Mix with me. Hopefully you guys have been busy um, trying to gain Snorlax into your cafe. Because if you guys haven't, you have totally <laughs> missed out on the big friendly uh, cushion. <laughs> so yeah, as you can tell, the banners for Snorlax event has disappeared. And we are now getting a brand new customer adding to the uh, list of attainable Pokemon. So as you can tell, it starts on the 8th of October, which is basically today, right now that I'm filming. And yeah, so no more stages added, so we are once again um, struggling <laughs> to fill up all the stages into a whole series. But that's okay, it just means more content or for my channel <laughs> all right so yeah here we go to deliver a fun puzzle experience we have made the following adjustments on the 7th oh that was yesterday improved the appearance of gummies that appear on order 261 hmm what was 261 can't really remember what stage it is but i'm definitely glad they decided to do something you know to make things a lot easier on certain people so there we go we have now 450 levels in total at this point in time so definitely looking towards completing that all right talking to Evie and woo we've got a new friend sneaking up hmm Hatrum? never have been very good with pronouncing its name hopefully I didn't butcher it <laughs> okay so, there we go, got some blah blah blah. So it's the traditional event style. Um, definitely want to try and pace yourself with this one. Unlike Snorlax, Snorlax was definitely a grind. Um, oh, there we go, we've got to claim some stuff here. You can probably tell I didn't do much grinding after the last video. Okay, but we did manage to get Snorlax to join the crew, so that's all good. Um, you can probably just level up Snorlax through the traditional method of giving good cards. Alright, place 42. Hmm. I thought I'd be worse considering I didn't play much after Snorlax video. Okay, but I did do very well on my Nintendo Switch console though, so yeah. Alright, so let's do our... Ooh, we've got Lucario on the line. So this is probably the best time to have Lucario join the crew. Alright, let's go for it. Okay, 60,000 score. Sugar cubes and popcorn kernels. So, okay, we might not want to rely on luck for this one. Because Starly's skill is kind of very luck based. We're just gonna go with these some food creams here. Um, yeah, we're gonna get together some Starly because um, we don't have enough icons for the rest of the amount of points required to get the skill up. There we go. Hmm. Slurpuff maybe? Because it looks like there's more Slurpuff on the ball. There we go. We did power up. Hopefully, you know, megaphones will be used to destroy the popcorn. Oh, dang. All in the wrong directions. It's just really not lucky. And that's why I say don't rely on, you know, RNG for luck. Okay. Mm. Let's go like this. Okay, we can destroy the popcorn just with the skill. And hopefully, you know, megaphones once again. Can't fully rely on megaphones. Luckily, we have one more move. Let's just get rid of the last time with cream. We could have just gone with the icons. You know, if we want to play safe, 
just in case you accidentally shift your finger while holding the steel. And there we go, we have Lucario joining the crew. Alright. Come on, boy. Put on that uniform. Nice. Alright. Now that we have our powerful friend joining us, things will look a lot blissful in certain stages, I suppose. 70,000 score. Ooh. Okay, so definitely we want to try and power up Stoutland's skill to destroy a majority of the chestnuts at one go. So let's just gather as many Stoutlands as we can. Okay, it's about the Cario icons. Let's just do this. Okay, we got the first one out. Slow path, so let's just get a slow path. Okay, let's get a Lucario because we're only a tiny bit away from getting the skill off. There we go. Power this up. Okay, we're just gonna destroy the majority of them. Oh, nicely done there, the megaphones. Um, sadly to say, we don't have a megaphone that's facing the direction that we can abuse, you know, to destroy chestnuts. So that's kind of a bummer. Hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna go slow up and get rid of the last. Hmm. megaphone this time round. <laughs> I thought we might have to use one more move just to destroy the last chestnut. Okay. So Lady Luck was on our side that time round. Alright, party time is over so let's move on with the regular stages. Okay. Okay, he requires executor. Although we could have stayed with Stoutland. Wait. Okay, so I guess the trick here is to clear as many of the caramels to make room for more icons. Go. Um, technically, we could destroy the Marshmallow skill first, you don't really have to power up the skills. There we go. Okay, so while they are busy rotating around, let's get rid of the caramels. How are we gonna... There's no way? Okay, luckily we have a megaphone. There you go. So all we do is get a whole bunch of starlings. Let's go on going. Thank goodness we had the megaphone. You know, considering that the caramel did kind of put us in a pinch right there. Oh. Who's next? Oh, we're in second place. Bob whistle. Let's go. Ooh, lots of Starly on the board. Is this a single icon stage? Ooh, but look at that. It's requiring 10 megaphones, so 
Definitely Starly skill is gonna benefit us. We're gonna okay the first thing we definitely need to do is destroy all the ice. It's really in the way. Okay. Sugar cubes to have more space for my coins. There we go, getting all the vegetables at the same time. Okay. Alright, let's gather more veggies. Alright, starting. There we go. Veggies, veggies got all. We do need the score, so let's just go with more icons for now. Okay, vegetables are done. Um, yeah, score. Okay, we should have just gone for sugar cubes. There we go. And let's clear the mega phones. The score will definitely come along, considering that we have a whole bunch of mega phones at the level. There we go. Easy peasy. Next, hopefully we've got our brand new friend in line. Ooh, we got first place. Oh, Meowth. Okay. So just taking a look in the line. No, no, no sight of our new friend. Hmm. It's kind of sad. Ooh, honey is in the way. Oh no. Oh, thank goodness the baskets are all on each lane. So, getting the tomatoes in won't be that difficult. Okay, it's just the problem with the marshmallows though. Uh, let's, let's clear out the marshmallows here first. Because they're all lighted up. Go. And now we can handle the honey right after we clear the marshmallows, I guess. Why is there one there? Alright, let's get rid of the top row. Power this up. And we are good. Unless we are still lacking in score. Yes, we are definitely lacking in score. Oh no! Okay, so the tomato is having some problems trying to get in. Alright, let's get a whole bunch of icons. If we can actually power up the skill, that would be great. Not with this. There we go. So once we've done that, we can destroy the icons to let the tomato easily flow into the basket. Oh come on! Oh you gotta be kidding me! <laughs> that was unfortunate, so we ended up using all our moves. But hey! At least we cleared the stage. Okay, next was execu Executor. Why am I fumbling? <laughs> oh, we're in second place now. Someone's getting busy. Alright. Oh no, there's a lot of chocolate. Okay, there's popcorns as well. So maybe while we're trying to power up the skill, let's destroy the popcorns. So beautiful, please. Okay. There we go. Um, there's a few toga piece this time. There we go. Okay, so let's power this up. Can we get all the Oh, we missed one. Oh, come on. Okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna get her more skill icons. Alright, let's make use of charging to destroy the popcorn and the chocolate. There we go. Now that we have this. Oh, you're gonna be kidding me. Why did they not cover the same amount the last round? Oh no. Oh 
Oh no, am I in trouble? Oh no. Okay, that's going down. Well, there we go. Oh no, did I miss one? Oh, I missed one! Oh, that's so unfortunate. Okay. Wait, is that- Oh no, there's still a popcorn. Oh, why did I mess up this one so badly? Okay, let's retry. Okay, hopefully we don't mess up again. Go. Uh, no. Okay, let's get more skills. Targeting the chocolate at the top. Just in case. There we go. Oh no. I missed out too. That's fine. Oh, the milk's stuck. <laughs> um, okay. Maybe let's give them a little push. Okay, let's clear these guys out. Alright, now that we have this going. Drawing the chocolate. That's kind of a bummer. There we go. Okay. We are destroying all the chocolate plus the popcorn at one go. And that now, the only thing is we have to shift this way. So, yeah. Not a difficult stage. Just placement, I guess. And of course, the know how on using up a power up skill. Um, it was rather unfortunate for the first try. <laughs> okay, so let's move on. Ooh! We're getting new decorations. Oh, we're actually upgrading the cafe. Interesting. Okay. Let's do some upgrades then. I wonder who else will be joining the cafe. Okay, ooh, piping bags. That's not a good thing. Hmm. Three chestnuts on the board. All of them are pretty spread out though. Okay, so let's go with the center lane first. Get up there with cream. Push. Then we can actually push all the chestnuts to the middle lane. That would be great. If we can do that, that is. Okay, maybe not. Um, okay, we're gonna get rid of the chestnuts plus the tree. Here. There we go. Okay. So the main thing here is to get all the whipped cream out and, of course, at the same time. Let's try to get the vegetables going. So all the whipped creams are out. So we're gonna destroy all the creams here before moving, moving on to the next lane. Alright, everything is set up here. Okay, so we just need another skill. simple as long as you pay attention to the lanes I suppose yeah. don't really have to power up the skill this time around okay let's see 
what the new section of the cafe is gonna look like. me of oh <laughs> Ordino so cute <laughs> I kind of like the way it's illustrated here um re in instead of the regular game illustration because the regular game one makes it look a lot taller so the pudgier chibi version looks actually a more adorable yeah so this room does remind me of um if you guys are following me for Utam and cross content in the past I'm sure you are familiar with Ranka's, um, I would say, um, brand new song, Ranka and the brand new Peach costume, you know, where she's like wearing a pajama set that is like a unicorn and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, this room really does remind me of that, so if Ranka was an element type in Pokemon, I guess, fairy? <laughs> Although we have a galaxy fairy already, Shadow Gnome, but she doesn't act like a fairy type, so <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so a bit of Macross talk right there. Yeah, Pokemon video. <laughs> okay, so, ooh. Lots of Mingonis in the mean. Oh no, has pumpkins. There's a requirement for 35 links as well. Okay, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to make use of Togepi. Oh, we didn't destroy all the marshmallows. Okay, that's a bad thing. I suppose. Let's clear the cheese as well. So we definitely need to open up, you know, all the areas to get that 25 link. There we go. Dinos. Marshmallow's done. Now the only problem is okay. So let's go in. Power up to the piece. Okay, there we go. Um, technically we can just use Pikachu. Oh, Doctor Four. Dang, we're short of one. Okay, so the problem is finding the pumpkins. Yeah, the pumpkins. Oh, there we go. We've got three of them. Um, so I'm hoping that the, the rest of the pumpkins are inside. May I honest, I'm targeting right now. Okay, all five of them are out. So I don't really have to bother with the other May honest. Bubble? still don't have our 35, so that's a problem. Oh no, that doesn't look enough. Okay, we got our 35. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> that was nerve-wracking. Hey, we cleared it on the last move as well. Oh my goodness. Okay, definitely want to pay attention on that level, especially if you get a friendship bonus on it. Oh, hello! Nice to see our two new friends in line. Hey, looks... look. Ethram is here. It's not a Pokemon we usually see around here. Hopefully our yummy offerings turn it into a fan of our cafe. I'm sure it will eventually when you stuff a Pokemon down with good food. Um, it, it feels like this game is all about bribery with food. <laughs> you know, but you know, anyone anyone can get bribed easily with food, even myself. I, I'm a, um, I love to eat, so uh, yeah, it's definitely a downfall for me. <laughs> okay, let's get to it. Um, let's do some Pikachus first. Clear out the sugar cubes. Um, technically, we don't really have to clear the sugar cubes yet. Okay, we need to make use of the chocolate or rather the sugar cubes to hold that level. Um, the ones at the bottom here because we need that foothold. Um, oh, no, no, no. Do not destroy those. Do not destroy those. Okay, 
We need to power up um, Mijino skill so we can get a full straight line into station. Okay, at the same time, we're trying to get the score going. Here we go. Once that is done, let's destroy the here first. Go destroy the one that's holding it in place. There you go. So all of them just slide in. Yeah! So that's the strategy. Okay, now we can go for this. Simple as that. And the score now. So let's get all the pikas. And make sure we hit the last shoot. Done! Simple as that. So as long as you know the strategy for this stage, this stage is not that difficult. Unlike making that cake, of course. <laughs> making that cake in real life is one hell of a chore. I, I know, because I used to be a chef. Well, I, I wasn't exactly a patissier, but you know, I did dabble a bit in it, so I do know how difficult it is to make a cake that fancy looking. Um, it takes a lot of time. Okay, let's try to get Audino to join us as well. Or the Audino might make need some work, because it's a regular Pokemon, not an event Pokemon. Okay, uh, let's uncoat all of these first. Okay, we definitely need to power up Squirtle's skill, so we can um, get the full benefit of the stretch. So, okay, now that we've got the skill powered up, let's get all the Mayonnaise bubbles. Okay. Pikachu's, lots of Pikachu's. Let's get rid of all the caramel. Possible. Don't want them to spread. One caramel left inside there. Oh, we didn't hit it. That's fine. Hello. Okay, now that we got Squirtle's skill, let's get all the popcorns. And we're done. Simple as that. Okay, moving along. All you know needs 12 stars. Yeah, I guess that's what happens when you're a Pokemon that can't evolve. <laughs> okay. So I, I'm still wondering when they will release Ordino's like maybe baby for version. Because I remember the day when Chansey didn't even have Happy Me. <laughs> so Ordino feels exactly the same. So eventually maybe Ordino might evolve and maybe it might have a baby form as well. Hmm, who knows? Looking forward to the you know the future of Pokemon. Alright, stop it, let's get going. Um Okay, so the strategy for this one is just basically not to over clutter um the space. If you can destroy as much of the honey so you can get more icons falling into the room. So, and of course, definitely need to set free all the particles from the yeah, bubble cages. There you go. Um, if you can bring all the pumpkins together, um, that will definitely be a good help when it comes to you know destroying all of them. So hopefully that does something. Close enough. Okay, so let's see. Oh no. Oh no, what a waste of a megaphone. Oh well. Okay. Let's just get a whole bunch of stuff in go. Um, okay. It would be great if both of the pockets were close to each other so we can you know, use the least amount of moves possible, but you know. We still have a bunch of moves available, so 
why not just make use of them? Play safe. Although there are less acorns in the game, but you know, clearing the stage is still the utmost importance. Hmm. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait a while before we see the two friends again. Oh, we're in third. Oh, there it is. The notification to say that we have played 10 stages. Or rather, going to play our 10th stage. Lots of gifts we have not used. <laughs> okay, so Jigglypuff, let's go. a lot of worrying um, olives um, oh boy and then there's the canisters that are stuck in that bubble of doom definitely try not to pop the olives I guess because uh, this this is going to happen Items and prevent the coating of olive oil. You know that would be fantastic. Still, okay. Um, we do have a few moves available. Oh, what? You gotta be joking! Why did I not release this canister? Okay, one is in. Um, we're gonna have to set some food, just like this. Okay, now we just swirl things around. Where did it go? Oh no, did I knock it to the other side of the room? Oh no, I didn't. <laughs> okay, so all we have to do is just destroy the cans and we're done. It could have ended a lot faster, but you know. Things just didn't go well in placement. But that's fine. Oh, getting more decoration now. Ooh, eggs. Oh, ooh, we're serving breakfast now? Cool. Alright, we're gonna do a longer video for this episode. Um,. Definitely because we are we are kind of lacking behind in terms of completion right here. Um, so yeah, well, let's move along. Hopefully we can get our friend to join us within this episode. I don't know. We are still four stars away from having uh, Hetrim to join us. Okay, to get an egg out of basket, make a combo next to the basket or hit it with a skill or megaphone. Pretty simple. 50 eggs. Oh, oh, the baskets move. Oh, that's, that's pretty interesting. Okay. Let's get the Arduinos going. So, definitely want to gather them together in a circle. Yeah, that's a much surface area. Right, now that we have the skill, I don't know, is this water in this? Oh, we are short of one! <laughs> that was unfortunate. Alright, tutorial level. Easy peasy. Oh, Executor is getting the friendship bonus. Which is great for us, for the Grand Prix position. Plus, of course, leveling up Executor as a friend as well. Oh, surprisingly, we're still on third. Second and first must be really working hard. Alright, let's keep going. Hmm. Alright, ooh. Okay, so considering that our main Pokemon is, you know, having a skill that destroys things upwards, let's just focus on maybe 
attacking the casing of the sugar cubes for the time being. And of course powering up the skill bar. Here we go. So we can just level this up and destroy all of this at one go. And from here we can just power up more skills. And of course at the same time get us some things. to remember getting the score Jeez. there we go we've got our second one let's destroy all the necessary stuff alright and then let's go get our eggs there you go so simple well the first few stages of a new brand new introduction of our item, so yeah. Oh, 34 stars for the next level. Oh my goodness. Executor, you one big boy. Oh, we're in second place now. Okay. Oh, Weasel, I don't have you yet, so. Dang, you are still 4 stars away. 100,000 score? Mmm, there's piping bags. Okay, food baskets as well. So, definitely want to. I think we should go for the. the things first. Okay, we do have the skill here, so let's just the use of this common things. At the same time, you know, using the megaphones to hopefully destroy. Um, something. Okay, we've got all the whipped creams out, so that's great. Um, okay, we could. Yeah, let's do this. So, a bunch of whipped creams to be destroyed there. Okay, I was hoping to get more vegetables out from that. I guess maybe luck is just not on our side. Eggs and vegetables. And grocery shop. Okay. Well, so that's the majority of the whipped cream. And a bit of score. Cheese. That should be our last whipped cream as well. Okay, so the only thing left is eggs. So let's go with Pokemon icons. Okay, as long as we cover the two baskets, we're done. There we go. Simple as that. So as long as you don't lose focus on what needs to be done, that stage shouldn't be a hassle. Celebi's flying around. <laughs> So Hatrim is back for more. That's nice. If only we had a friendship bonus on it. <laughs> oh. Okay, lots of items that are easily destroyed with skills. So while powering up the skill, let's get rid of all the marshmallows. Go. up some more. Alright, and majority of the marshmallows are gone. Oh, few are left. Okay, let's just get rid of the chocolate first, because we need more space for icons. Now we're gonna have to waste two moves just to have that marshmallow appear. 
Oh, we probably should have gone for the marshmallow first instead. Oh, that was a bad choice. Bad decision right there. It's okay. At least, when I fail to do something, you guys learn to avoid to do it for yourself. So yeah. Three more stars. Along. Oh, our very first use of Lucario. Let's see how its skill is like. 100,000. Oh! Wow, do you see the arrows on Lucario's skill? All four sides. Ooh. Okay, let's get Togepi going. Um, I guess right now the main objective is to. Clear popcorns, I suppose. Since you can use Lucario's skill to destroy things in whatever direction. There we go. Okay, let's power up Lucario's skill. Oh, look at that brain! Holy crap! Okay, we definitely need another of Lucario's skill to finish the level. Here we go. Okay, let's power this up. Oh, we didn't get the... Oh, oh no. Okay, so this is a problem. We can do this. Now the last one is an issue. Yeah, there we go. Just gonna be careful that it at least goes into the target area. <laughs> okay. The Terra is looking very happy working for us. Ooh, we are in first place now. Nice. Oh wait, we are we are tied. <laughs> so we still need to clear this level to really secure our first place position but then again this account is mainly used for making videos so I don't really play that often on this account hmm 80,000 oh no olives coated in uh this is a horrible stage okay okay let's get rid of all the honey First. Okay, we do have one skill right now. Okay. Do we need to power up our skill? I don't know. Oh no. Why oh, why did I move away? I was gonna try to target. Horrible choice. Yeah, like I was saying, I was gonna move towards the other side with more olives that coated. That was really a bad choice. Very bad choice. Honey activated the skill. Uh, this is bad. This is not looking good for us. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to retry this level. This is, this is just very bad play. It's not worth the 900 acorns. But... So, I was struggling with this level. So, we have to do this strategy right now. We're gonna leave the honey on the top with the olives there to hold them in place while we power up Pikachu's skill um, and destroy the honey at the bottom. So, yes, let's go with this strategy for now. Go. So once that is in place, let's just 
This is for coating. Okay, then at the same time, since these are now coated with olive oils, we have to go set them free. And while powering up our next skill, yeah, there we go. So we can use this skill. Uncoat those olives. Fantastic things. Things looks like they are moving along nicely. Uh, of course, making sure that we destroy the olives that we have set free. Fantastic. Okay, so the main plan is still to uncoat whatever we have coated the olive oil. Okay. Alright, let's get rid of the honey here, I suppose. In one hit? Yes, we can! Oh my goodness! Okay, so this is definitely one of the trickier levels. You need to be very precise with your planning. Um, if you mess up a bit, and especially if you waste a move trying to set free icons or olives, you know, from their captivity capsules, um, you're gonna end up retrying this stage a lot, just like what I did off camera. <laughs> So, uh, <laughs> yeah, definitely plan wisely, play smart, and play carefully. I mean, if you are a few moves away from clearing the level, use that 900 acorns, you know, give you that 3 moves extra. Finish it up, you know, definitely worth the 900 acorns right there. Okay, so let's move on. Oh, Squirtle, haven't seen you in a while, so... Okay, let's try to level up Squirtle. 70,000 score. Ooh, pumpkins. Uh, okay, since Meowth destroyed things towards the left, let's push everything towards the left side. Okay, so we can push the pumpkins out all to the left side as well. Great. Just like that. Yeah, I think we might need to level up your skill. Let's do that. Okay. Let's push this guy out. Make sure you cover all of the pumpkins. Okay. Now we're gonna try to move the milk carton over. Good! Not that difficult, as long as you pay attention to the skills direction. Simple. Oh, very close to Squirtle's max level. So if you guys didn't know, yes, level 3 is currently the cat level that you can have your Pokemon level up to. Okay, Brizzle is coming in. There's so many chocolates. We're gonna pay attention to those icons that are coated in bubbles as well. Hmm. Okay, um, blossoms. Let's just get these uncoated first. Okay. as many things as we can. Fantastic, we got extra chocolate destroyed. Okay, go. setting free the chestnuts. Powering up more. Alright, so let's see if leveling up. Yeah, we have more surface area covered. So we can destroy all the chocolates. Ooh, none of the megaphones hit. Oh, that's a bummer. Okay, so let's get more blossoms going. Okay, don't need to power up this one. All 
Alright, all the megaphone requirements are clear. So now we just need to con uh, destroy the chocolate. I was going to say control the chocolate. How do we control chocolate? <laughs> that too difficult hmm. oh apparently we got replaced at first just for a moment but that's fine okay slip off let's go hmm lots of frozen tomatoes Oh, the baskets are on two sides though. Okay. Um, I think the main priority is just releasing the whipped creams first. So let's do this bit by bit. Oh, we do have caramels. Oh god. Okay. Come on, come on. So, bit by bit, let's set things free. Okay. Plus the whipped creams are definitely essential things that we need to clear. Okay, now that we have this, let's, let's just... Oh, I missed one row of the ice cubes. Oh, that's just bad. Okay. One in. Oh no. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna go with 900 acorns right now because all I have to do is just uh, clear the path to load the tomato. Dang! That was unfortunate. Gino gets the friendship bonus. And wait, is this our 10th level? I mean, you know, it's sets of 10. So we have two stars on this level. Oh, it is! Oh, we're getting six stars. Nice. That means we can actually clear the stage in one try. <laughs> okay. Oh, Hatram is back. Oh, Baba Saw, you're the chosen one. Let's do this, let's get our 6 stars worth of friendship levels. Oh, goodness gracious me, why does this stage look so messy? Okay, so... Okay, Bobasaur does destroy things in the cross position, so... Let's figure out the best placement for Bobasaur's skill, I suppose. Hmm. Like this? Fine. We'll give us more space for icons. And yes. So and we'll kind of put all the egg baskets as well. Let's get all the sorts going. Okay. There we go. Alright, so as long as you know where to place your skills, I think you should be fine. Oh, we do have a link of 30 to the game. Hmm. Hmm. I missed one. Oh, come on. So we have got all the fruit cans set up. Definitely had more than 30 icons on the table right now. Okay, let's just keep 
going. Let's wrap the baskets up with icons. And of course, if we can do this, majority of icons. We will have our score easily. Oh, wait. Why did I not settle my 30? Uh oh. Okay. This is a problem. Okay, we're gonna have to change all these to. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have to do this. Because if we want the friendship bonus activated, we are definitely going to need to do this. Oh no. Such a waste though. I'm just gonna use all my moves just to be sure. There we go. We should have more than enough icons to cover the 30. I I was sure that I actually covered 30 earlier. So strange though. Huh. Oh well. There we go. 900 acorns well spent, kinda. <laughs> And there we have our very first maxed out level Pokemon. Alright guys, that's it for today. We're in first place. <laughs> Alright, so we are going towards getting um, Hatrim to join our cafe and hopefully we you know you know we have Ordino as well and a few more other Pokemon that have yet to join our cafe so eventually we'll get them all in um we are still a long way to go from you know reaching the end of the um current amount of levels available because dang 450 you know that's still quite a long way we are like literally 110 levels away from completing the current available stages guys what do you guys think of the game so far was Snorlax event too grindy for your taste? Um, did you get Snorlax at all? Did you fail to get Snorlax at all? Let me know all your thoughts in the comments down below. And of course, if you are brand new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button for more content just like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, bye!